Hello, and welcome back to Wonderful Techmas. So last episode, we had set up these. We go up here, we got 17 and 14. We set up this. I emptied this out of the other stuff. And, um, I kind of want to see today if I can get it, like, if with our new uh, chocolate brick somehow. Oh, I know how he did that. I'll get to that in a moment. Um, mostly because partially of what I am trying to do today will determine if it works the way that I want it to. I forgot that we need to call the elevator. That's why we built this thing. We didn't put a stop yet on that floor. So, like, can you, bla can you really blame me? Now we need sugar. Gotta keep our production going. Like to try to have a whole chest full of all of our stuff. Cocoa beans. Two more stacks of sugar. Well, actually, I'm gonna eat three more stacks. One, two, three. Go up here. Uh, that. That. If I did this correctly. Oh, I need to power, or not power them, I need to fuel them. So we set up filters on these, so this should, in theory, only ever produce white chocolate. This should only ever produce dark chocolate. So if we add some power, we see the white, we see the dark, and it's working. We're getting more. In theory, that also should mean that if I throw a stack into there, and a stack into there, well not a stack, we don't need a whole stack. Right, mundane potion. It gets drained out. We got one bottle of mundane potion in here. One bucket of mundane potion here, actually. So now if I power this, It'll go down, and this is really where it matters. See, it's got candy cane now. It's still got candy cane. Still candy cane. That might be because I did let this do it a little bit ahead of time. That might have been all that we needed, is to power this slightly afterwards. Because so now we've got lots of candy canes. We have so many candy canes. It has not made caramel yet. Okay, so there it ran out, and now it has to, it's waiting for its next batch. Okay, so it is, it looks like it will work. This is what we've got to work on next. So it occurred to me that we have a lot of candy, like a lot of candy things, right? We got a whole, but we got like 25 buckets here, another 22 buckets there. I think we have like 88 buckets of, um... The regular cocoa, which we should also... Ah, cocoa. Oh, I can hear somebody's leaving. Gertrude, probably. If we throw those in there, we can light that up. Make regular chocolate. Now, if I've done this correctly, we won't see any. Yep, no white chocolate in there. And it has 32 and 32 instead of the 31 because it ran out of... The other chocolate. So that's good. Gertrude is back already. Yeah, good. So we got chocolate production down. Another one that we need to do is I put the caramel buckets over here. We are going to want to have caramel consistently. Um, we still have a little bit of mundane potion left in there. So that's all good. We got everything working as intended. Um, obviously, the base still needs a lot of love. Um, this one's my favorite one, though, because I can just grab, 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 run over here, and just go plop, 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 and it'll do its thing. And then if we go back down, I just picked up something. The constant sound of fire, as I say every episode, is alarming. This is how I got that chocolate brick. I don't want this chocolate brick. 
I can melt it back down into chocolate. Um, so I accidentally also did make a couple chocolate bars. But so if we go over here and we label this chocolate bars, now I can put the cogwheel back on here like it's supposed to be. Not that direction. That direction. It'll then pump the chocolate in here and this will smash it into chocolate bars. Now ideally when it hits four, because we have this, it should not. Yes. Perfect. It will not turn it into chocolate bricks. Um, run to grab our goodies out of here. Ralph goes back to his thing. Um, we got quite a bit of ginger dough. We need more. More ginger dough, for sure. And now we've got chocolate bars. Um, I throw that and that in there. Cocoa beans can all go in there. And these, we go out here. And we throw them in the compost here. And so we've got everything. Everything is running. We're doing it. We're doing it. We have actually, like, you know, accomplished something here. Feels good. So one, one thing of charcoal will get us through roughly about half, a little over half, a stack of the items. Which is fine. We would love to get a little bit more wheat flour and some cinder flour. Um, just because it's a little... I got a hundred for... I mean, we can do this. Actually, we can do two, two stacks. That'll give us a good chunk. Um, so another issue that I am slightly running into is that I have no other way of powering these. Right, so I'm in, I'm out of andesite again. If I add anything else to this windmill, it'll go too much, too much stress. Um, I could try to run stuff from here, but this guy, let's go grab our stressometer. Oh, look at that. I can't see what floor we're trying to go to. One. That's where we want to go. Oh, don't do that. How did I just get that? Get that back in there. I actually grabbed it out of the chute. How in the world did I do that? Okay, but this has been just chugging, chugging, chugging away. No, don't do that. Oh, we got to do it with an empty hand and grab them there. So there we go. We now have chocolate bars. We can make a full chocolate bar with some wrapping paper. Smash them, smash them. Wrapping paper. Melt it back down. This is what we want to fill them. We can do ruby chocolate. We can do dark chocolate chocolate. And we can do white chocolate chocolate. That's all we can do with those. Which means that we should make some spouts. Which, unfortunately, isn't really going to be a possibility. Because right, I can do this. Get us some more of these. That'll be good because we want to do just two, I think. Because I don't think we can use the chocolate to cover anything. Maybe the caramel can get covered by chocolate. Uh, and we need some spouts, I said, right? Spouts are on page one, which is copper casings. So I have copper in my inventory. I'm trying to think ahead here a little bit. And then we grab them. And then we want those. We, I don't have any depots. But if we grab... Oh, there's our, spin our stressometer. If I do that, and that, I can grab those. 
take a nap. Today's episode is going to be a shorter one because I just have to go do some stuff and it's already, already late. So the problem is I am out of andesite. Level four, well, three, four, depending on how you want to look at this. Right, so we got that side. On this side, I think we're going to do the other. The Oh, cool. It's raining. Um, we need that. Well, the problem here is we don't want... Because I was going to try to do the same thing. But if I do the same thing, it won't. I could probably... All right, we're going to do it like this. We're going to probably put a belt across the bottom of both sides here. So if I put this like there, not like that, please. There and there. That will allow us to do it this way. And I'm thinking if we do the same thing this way, so if we put just put no again wrong put that there with the spout there rotate that and that would allow us if I had the andesite to do it I mean I can do this right bam there um, make the belts because that would allow us to do what I want to do which is that like that that one there and then same thing over here just do a little short guy with the idea being that both of them will converge into the same spot and we can fill them up that way if I'm lucky and I put the gearbox here it'll make it go both towards the middle rather than away from it. But of course that's not going to happen. Down here we've got... I'm going to grab... We want to just basically be trying to constantly be making stuff at this point in the game. So if I were better I'd have a much larger um, farm for everything. We still have to also get hot chocolate production. And then if we go over to this one, we grab the cocoa beans and the sugar. Oh, I already grabbed sugar. If we grab the cocoa beans and that, we can throw them into here. Light that up. This, I mean, we, as much as we would like to make more cinnamon rolls, or sweet rolls, sorry. Sweet rolls. Oh, did I have more cinder flour down here? I probably did. Um, as much as we would like to make more sweet rolls, we actually already have almost an entire box of sweet rolls. Which is good, because that's what we want to have. This is perhaps one of my favorite things. It's just this elevator. And Gertrude goes off. Yet again, to go collect all of our milk. Milk production was easy. I mean, granted, I made a lot of cows. Ralph does not do as good. I mean, this should be... It does, that's not empty. Gertrude, don't run me over. And so this one should be out of... No, it's got two cocoa beans. But it'll swing around and pick up on that one. Our sugar cane thing is doing its thing. See, look, nothing's in here, which means Ralph does have items in his inventory. Ralph is just not helping our production. Um, 
feel like we didn't really accomplish anything on today. But, like, we're also, like, at the point in the series where, like, I need to, like, spend a solid day just doing stuff before, like, we can really get further. And I know that this one wants more cocoa beans. So, like, these two guys, we can just power them up. That guy needs the cocoa beans. At least he just eat the thing. I don't think we have enough up here to make another batch of candy canes without powering this back up. We'll see how much it gets through. I'm going to guess not a ton because it uses 250 millibuckets every time. So yeah, it's already out. That was it. That was all we get. Caramel would be an easy one. We could easily get a lot of caramel. Gertrude's coming back. Oh, she's leaving actually. This, I mean, this is very satisfying to me though. Like, I feel like in the past we've notoriously like not really accomplished much. I need to have this set up so that it'll just dispense the chocolate bars. But as you can see, we're a little like strapped on space. I'm not sure what we do with the full chocolate bars. Oh, we can enchant the full chocolate bars? How do, how, what? What is the point of a full chocolate bar? That I would need to give it unbreaking and or mending. I'm a little confused. Why would you enchant? Can I enchant the regular chocolate bars? We gotta see. Am I allowed to enchant chocolate? No. Why can I enchant full chocolate? But, you know. If I had... This is like more of a proof of concept episode. If I had the ability to, we would have. Why do I have sugar cane in my inventory? Let's go throw that in the grinder. If I had the current resources to <laughs> power the other ones, we would have them powered. And then we would have more items. But unfortunately, we do not have access to that. I got the crushed cocoa. Throw another stack of regular cocoa beans in there. Go throw these in the grinder. And there we go. I think we're going to call it today's episode here just because, like, it's late. And the, really, the problem is without, like, just actually going and, like, doing a bunch of mining and stuff, I can't really do much at the moment. Things that we still would like to ideally get done before the season is over is sugar with cocoa powder and milk to make hot chocolate my all-time favorite drink in the world is hot chocolate so we definitely need some of this this is the problem is I'm going to need a lot of glass bottles luckily um, you know we can uh, just make them glass sea glass shards Sea glass shards for what? No, I'm joking. Bulk blasting. Sand. Bulk washing. Stuff that's painted. Trade bees. No. Why is he like this? Why are you like that, man? Why is it wanna... I can also get, you know, fire essence and dirt essence. Grind some gravel. To get these, we need to make fire ag agglomerato. We don't want to do that. We got a good thing going here. We got. I mean, I need to actually like patch up the base so that it's not leaking all the time. But like, other than that, right? Like, we're doing good. We're doing good things. Please, no. Don't eat the. We're not allowed to eat it. We're just making it. 
Uh, the eggs, we could make, you know, like, fancy cakes and stuff. What is there, like, left in here? We got the sweet rolls. We got the chocolate bars. Chocolate glazed berries. That could be another thing that we could do. Take our sweet berries and glaze them. That would be tasty. Builder's tea. Honeyed apples, which would be spouting honey onto apples. Makes sense. Um going through here oh marshmallows right for you know, honey candy and I really want to make this bright side this but I don't have hold on I know I said that we're gonna be done but I really want to make the bright side disc it's nighttime though gotta go to sleep all right going over here real quick Take a nap. Um, shove all the candy stuff into the backpack. Give me that. That'll probably be enough. Up to floor three. Which is actually going to be floor four by the end of the series. Um, grab me one of these. Why would you go on that side? Almost a full bucket in each. Alright, we're good. Give me that. <laughs> I didn't think that was going to work. Alright, I can turn one. That's all I needed. I can't hand crank both of them. I'm not strong, strong enough. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Bars of dark chocolate. So now, we're going to do this, and it's going to end up being like copyright music, which is going to be hilarious. What? How I make? Oh, just like that. Bam. This isn't Christmas music. I'm waiting to see if it turns into Christmas music. I mean, you know, it's alright music. Make dark chocolate bars. Which I assume we can then enchant the dark chocolate bars. Of course, why not? Soothing hot chocolate with the marshmallows. Oh, yeah. We might have the ch chocolate cake. Oh, why does it? How does it get a cherry in it? It's cheating. Why are these in mean, a different thing? <laughs> Whatever. We can make power armors too. Alright, stop this music. This is not Christmas music. Stop. It's not good Christmas music. There's a song called The Bright, Brighter Side of Christmas or something like that. One of my favorite like Christmas songs that I've played personally. That's not it. But we are going to call the episode. It's been like 20 minutes. I managed to do this every time. Say a short episode, still go for like 25 minutes. So for now, we're going to call it here. As usual, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed and I'll see you around for the next one.